guys, Sunny here from PositivelyStrong.com. One of the first things that we want to take a look at is essentially moving from the hip. Um, stance with your fist forward. You're going to be standing. I'm on my knees. I just want you to be able to get um, the full hip motion in there. But um, one of the things that I want you to concentrate on is you've got your fist facing where you're going to be punching as opposed to here, which is where some people hold their fists. But this one, you're here. And I want you to, instead of just arms out, concentrate on hip moves first. Hip makes that arm move out with more power. So hip, then back, hip, back. Okay. So again, instead of just arms, in this we have a one, two motion. So it's first punches are one, two, three, but I want you to concentrate on as you get better slowly, I want you to concentrate on hip first, hip, hip, hip. So hip moves forward, then the arm follows. Okay, so that's a full hip movement that it's following. And then there are movements that we're going to be making from um, a fighting stance, which means it's a front stance, one leg is forward, the leg that's forward, that arm is going to be forward as well. So in this position, again, same thing that hip moves, comes back, then the other. And the back leg, when you're standing, to make that hip move, usually you have to turn your ankle just a little bit, but not, not a crazy amount. So let me show you what I need. So that you're in the front stance, we've got one back. It doesn't need to be a complete full turn, okay? There's just point it to the front, the direction that it's going, okay? In karate, that really helps to be able to move you forward, move it back. With children, I call this the key. If you turn it, it's gonna, your body should be going in the direction that that foot is turned because your hips are now turned. So don't overturn here, front punch, one, then back punch, just the direction that you're punching. Hands up and punch. Okay? Single. More count. So one, two, three, four. As you get better, you're gonna do one, two, one, two. And as you master that, faster. Good job. After this, you've got the snatch. So get a somewhat heavy weight. Three, two, one. More count. You're going to punch up to the ceiling. Bring it up. Punch. It comes up, 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 up. Punch. Good job. Next one, same line again, this time stomach, head. Hands forward, Three, ready. Two, one, more count. One, two, one, two. Stomach, head, stomach, head. Stomach, head, stomach, head. One, two, three, four. And if you can speed that up, even better. Good job. Now we're going to be doing curtsy lunges. I'm going to get a somewhat light weight. Three, two, one. Move to more count. So one, switch, other side. Good 
it work. 15 seconds. Really feel that side. And your shoulders. Three, two, one. Rest. Good work. Other one now. We move on to the fighting stance. Left leg forward, left Three, arm forward. Two, one. Stum uh, head stomach. More count. So one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, okay? So now you have that, as fast as you can go. Almost done. Three, two, two one. Okay, let's... Now, I'm going to do thrusters with the left arm. Go so nice and low. Watch out. Squeeze your glutes. Down. Down. I try to keep the left count. So that when I do the other side, and I'm super tired then, I try to keep about the same amount. Good, now right side. So right stance, right arm up. Remember front punch goes out, and then comes back, back punch. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. Good, now that you have it quicker, Three, two, one. Good work. Now right arm thruster. Make sure you hold the angle. So Three, keep your two, hips one. nice and tight. Watch out. Down. Push up. As we come up, drive push up together. Almost done. Just a few more. Three, two, one. Rest. Good work. Now we've got sit ups and punch as you sit up. Three, two, one. More count. Just a few more. Keep those fists nice and tight. Three, two, one. Rest. Good work. And your very last one, you need both those weights. Three, two, one. Shoulders Watch back. Out. Up. Fully. For upright pulls. We'll lose a little bit of rope tomorrow. So, before you do another set of all of these, take a 60 second or more rest. I'll keep it to probably less than three minutes before you three, do this again. Two, Just to maximize your results. Rest. Workout completed. Good work. That's so exciting. Upper body work is done. You can go back and do my front kick exercise. Uh, tap into our routine. And uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe below. I'd love to see you again next week. And uh, good job. Stay strong.